Hey guys, this is my first video ever, I would say. And I'm going to tell you all about my reptiles. First off, we've got Tango. He is my African fat tailed gecko, who's actually in a shed at the moment. Which is a wee shame. Just came in at this morning. Had him for about eight years now. He was my first reptile. Oh, sneezing away. Next we have Marcel, who's but one of my bearded dragons. This is my first bearded dragon. Has her for six months, roughly, maybe. No, must be a bit more than that. Probably about eight months. Absolutely lovely colours on her, as you can probably see there. And beside her ear. And if you stick her in the bath, she'll go a very, very light colour. Still quite small, considering some dragons. So I've got her in a, a lovely 6x2x2 by two by two foot room, which is here. And she lives with her, well, my, my beast, I say. Morgan, who again we've had for about six, seven months, but he's the oldest of the four dragons. He's about three and a half years old. Another one with absolutely lovely colours. He just lays around most of the time. And he's, but there he's, he's the biggest. tank as well. But over here is my other two dragons. These are my babies. They're only about six months old, seven months old. Getting absolutely huge. When I bought them, they were... They would sit on that part of my thumb. Absolutely insane. So that's one that's jive. Over here, Mr. Salsa. They're just living at three foot at the moment. They were in a six foot, but things changed, and you'll and you'll show you why in a minute. But yeah, that's that's where they're staying at the moment. Just a temporary thing, though. Uh, here we have Sneaky, or as I like to call him, Ghost. Which is my revealed chameleon. Had him a couple of weeks now. And he <coughs> is living in an exoterra flex area. 100 gallon, so about 4 foot high, 3 foot wide, roughly. By just under, or just over a foot uh, deep. He's still trying to get used. Absolutely stunning. I was wanting him for quite a while and my better half decided she would buy me one. Adventuring little snakes, I would say. And they've got.
got themselves a little three fit paradise with their head crabs, random hanging hay, which I thought was quite funky actually. And then the dragon. So yeah, this is their, this is their paradise. Together in this room, we have got the snakes, the beauties, the second part of beauties, the fat tailed gecko, and I forgot to mention I have also got four green anoles in there, but obviously I can't catch them. You can see one up there, kind of. Um, I won't be able to catch them as they are incredibly quick. Now I've got my veiled chameleon up there, he's in all his glory. And last but not least, I didn't show you him before, he's still not actually out yet. But, let's see if we can... He's in, he is in there somewhere. My golden tiger. Who lives in the bottom six foot tank. Um, he was recently just moved in here, as the babies were in this tank, but he was in the two or three foot tanks, um, and they basically just had a hole through them, but it wasn't quite big enough, so I thought I'd give him a little bit extra space, and it means I can decorate it a bit more as well. Um, I would try and get him out, but he's quite feisty. He'll end up absolutely killing me. But I'll do an update when he's more alive, more up and about. And I'll also do, I'll be doing another couple of videos as I've got a couple of reptiles through in the other room and a couple of crabs which you might want to see. Cool, right, well, peace out. This is Jelly Reptiles saying goodbye.